Hello and welcome here at WeatherDoc to a new issue of Live Talk Technology from Franconia for the Seas of the World. Today we want to show you how easy it is to integrate the AIS mop device, easy to mop, into an automatic life jacket. The Easy2 has a big advantage when to integrate into a jacket because you need only you only need to open the lower part of the jacket just lay the device between the folded bladder and just fixing the safety rope on an eyelash and that's it. Other units on the market you have to open the vest completely, you have to uh, fix the device on the, uh, on the tube with a plastic clip or something, you have to wrap uh, a rope around the entire bladder and, and uh, finally you have to reclose the jacket professionally, which is very difficult. Um, now I demonstrate how easy it is in detail. So here is the device, the easy to mop. And um, here every jacket has an uh, eyelash or something uh, familiar where to fix the safety rope. And you take the you take the easy to mop and place it between the folded bladder with the head down. I tell you afterwards why. Just lay it between the folded bladder, fix the safety rope with a knot. And that's it, but, but, there is a big novelty you have to take care of. Here you see this yellow slider, it's a magnetic switch. Since 2023, every AIS mop device, which is transmitting with DSC, needs a functionality to switch off, to deactivate every button and every automatic activation. And here the slider, you see it, it's in the disarmed position and that means every automatic functionality is deactivated. No, but no pressing the button, no automatic activation when water contact, and so on. So, please be sure that before you lay the unit between the folded letter, slide the yellow magnetic slider with a little pressure to the armed position on the left side of the unit, and now every automatic function is activated and also the button is activated. And now you can lay it, as I told before, between the folded letter with the head down, fix the rope and close the jacket. Here is a zipper, other jackets have a, a velcro fastener, doesn't matter, just the lower part of the jacket has to be opened to insert the unit and close it again. So why with his head down? In case of emergency the jacket activates by water, water contact, inflates and the unit is pushed out by the inflating bladder 
and is dripping underwater with the head down. So with head down is the best the best um, possibility to dissolve the tablet and to activate the unit by water contact the fastest way as fast as possible and then the unit comes to an upright position swims floats in front of you the antenna comes out automatically and the unit starts transmitting DSC and AIS so once more you open the jacket the lower part it's enough make sure that the unit is armed for automatic activation and then between the folded bladder with their head down the rope is fixed to the jacket I will do a simple simple knot just a moment not that simple here we are and that's it closing the jacket again that's it the unit is placed on the side of the jacket where the co2 cartouche is not placed so here is the water contact unit for inflating the jacket and on the other side you place the easy to mop inside and that's it you see you see how easy it is to integrate the unit into the jacket and when the unit comes out activated by water contact automatically the unit floats in front of you and starts transmitting DSC and AIS. Thank you for watching and within the next videos we will show you uh, a live activation, how it works. You can see in the in the next video where, uh, how it how it floats, uh, how the uh, antenna unrolls, and so on. So once again, thank you for watching. Bye bye.